I have the Samsung Galaxy S22 here and in today's video I'll be showing you how to boot this smartphone into and out of recovery mode. Now this guide not only works on the base model as shown here, but it will also work on the Galaxy S22 Plus, the Galaxy S22 Ultra, and the upcoming Galaxy S22 FE. Now many of us want to boot into recovery mode for a very specific reason. Maybe we need access to this menu to do things like perform a factory data reset when we can no longer boot into Android. We can also do things like sideload an over-the-air update from here. And the whole thing will even work even if you replace the stock recovery with a custom recovery like TWRP. Now before we can begin, for us to access this special boot mode on the Galaxy S22, we first need to have a USB cable ready and connected to our PC. So we're going to take our USB cable, we're going to connect one end to the PC, and the other end is going to go into the bottom of the Galaxy S22 itself. Samsung uses this requirement to prevent people from accidentally accessing recovery mode, but it does make it more difficult for anyone who doesn't have quick access to a computer. However, I have heard of this working with other devices though. So for example, if you have a pair of headphones that can plug into the USB port here, then it may work for you. So it's definitely something you should try before going even further in finding a PC in order to boot into recovery mode. So when you're ready, we're going to go ahead and plug in that USB cable. It's connected to our PC. We are then going to power off the Galaxy S22. Once we see the screen go black, we're going to wait a few seconds for it to completely power down. And since we have this USB cable connected to our PC, we're then going to see this charge indicator appear. After a few seconds of this blank charge indicator, it's going to show the actual percentage. And then when the screen goes black, we can then proceed with the boot process. So we have our Galaxy S22. It's connected to our PC with a USB cable and it is completely turned off. Now when you are ready, we're gonna press and hold the power and volume up buttons. We're gonna press both of these buttons down at the same time. And we're gonna do what I call a three count step to boot into recovery mode. So we're gonna hold these two buttons and we're gonna, we're gonna count one, two, and at three, we're gonna let go of the power button, but we're gonna continue holding that volume up button. And we're gonna continue holding that button down until you see this recovery mode menu screen appear. Once you see this recovery mode screen appear, we can then unplug that USB cable if you want. There's no need to keep it plugged into the phone. But you're gonna notice that we cannot interact with this menu using the touch screen. Instead, we need to use the volume and power buttons in order to navigate this menu. So like I said, many people will come in here to do a factory data reset. So they would need to use the volume buttons until the option they want is highlighted. And then they can press the power button to select that option. Now I'm gonna cancel out from here. But again, we can go through and navigate through any of these menu options using the hardware buttons instead of tapping on the screen itself. So I promised to show you how to exit recovery mode as well. And as mentioned, we're going, we have already unplugged our USB cable. It is no longer connected to our Galaxy S22. 
and we are just going to use the volume buttons to make sure that the reboot system now option is highlighted. And once that option has been highlighted, we're going to press the power button to select that option. You should see the phone screen turn black again, and it should boot you back into Android just like normal. Now, if you find that the phone is rebooting back into recovery mode, it may be that your phone is currently in a boot loop. And if that's the case, then you will need to do a factory data reset in order to recover the Android operating system so that you can boot back into Android. But as long as you are able to boot from recovery mode back into Android, that is how to safely exit recovery mode on the Samsung Galaxy S22, the Galaxy S22 Plus, and the Galaxy S22 Ultra.